Hey all you cool cats and kittens. This is Nick Pendergraf, Senior Manager of Training at Dude Solutions. I want to take a couple minutes today to walk you through your hub for the experience at Virtual Dude University 2020. So you're watching this video, which means you've received your email with registration information for the event. And once you receive that email, within it you're going to have a link to the event URL. Once you click that link, it's going to bring you to this page, which is going to allow you to set up your profile and log into the hub for the first time. So we're gonna click the login button. Then we're gonna enter in our information for the event. And once we enter in this information, it's gonna send us a verification email with a code that we're gonna to need to enter in right here to verify our registration for the hub. And then once you enter that here and hit verify, you will be logged into the app. Now that we're logged into the hub, I wanna point out a couple of really specific things that you need to make sure you do to maximize the value of your experience at Dude University. The first thing you're gonna to need to do is once you get into the hub, is go over on the left-hand side and we wanna explore the sessions that are available for us to attend and start creating our own schedule. So I'm gonna click on the All Sessions link here and then this is gonna bring us to a listing of the sessions that are available for Dude University. I can search for keywords to look for specific sessions. But what I'm gonna show you is here on the right-hand side using the filter button. And we can use the filter button to look at sessions that we have bookmarked, to look at particular speakers that we're interested in hearing, or what I'm gonna show you directly is look at sessions by track. And so I'm gonna click on the tracks option, and then we have, an op we have options for the various tracks that are included at Virtual Dude University. And so let's say I'm interested in best practices. I click apply, and I'm gonna see a listing of all the classes that apply to the best practices track. So for any session that you see in the list, you can click on the session to look at more information, And we can see a description of the session. We can see who the speakers are. But the most important thing here, when you look at a session and you determine that you're interested in it, you need to click this view webcast link. And this is gonna take you to a registration page for that event. And that page looks like this. And once you come to this page, if you're interested in attending this session, you're gonna need to enter in your information, first and last name and email address, and click the register button to sign up for the session. Now that we're back on the session page, I wanna make sure you understand that you can create your own customized schedule to track what you wanna do at Virtual Dude University. And you can do that by identifying a session that you're interested in and clicking on the plus icon. And if you hover over it, you see it says add to my schedule. And so if you click that plus icon, it's going to then put it in the My Schedule section, which is here on the left-hand side below All Sessions. So now I can see I've got the dude is beside you now and in the future session on My Schedule. And I can go through all the sessions in the list, find the ones I'm interested in. You know, let's say I want to go, you know, I'm, I'm in the education vertical. I work at a public K-12 school district. I want to go to the K-12 Industry Connect. I can add it to my schedule. And then you want to make sure, once you add it to your schedule, you go into the session details and again, click the view webcast link so that you can register for that specific session. Registering for the session is going to be key to you being able to participate in that session at Virtual Dude University. Now that you're starting to get an understanding of the sessions that are of interest to you at Virtual Dude University and starting to build out your schedule, I want to point out a couple other sections of the hub that you'll, you'll want to make sure you visit. If you go down under the event guide section, a couple of things I want to point out are the activity feed. Uh, this is going to be uh, like a social feed that you would experience like on a social media 
uh, type of app where people are posting pictures, people are posting questions. There's going to be a lot of engagement happening here. It's something you want to kind of keep uh, keep an eye on as you're going through Virtual Dude University to see if there are things of interest to you in there. Post a picture of your virtual setup. Ask a thought-provoking question of some of your peers. Uh, there's going to be thousands of people dealing with the same issues that you're dealing with on an everyday basis at this event, all trying to get value, all trying to learn, all trying to attend training. Um, and I think there's a great opportunity in the activity feed for you to engage with others and learn things that, that we may not be able to teach you in a session. Also, another area I want to point out outside of the activity feed is the social game. The social game is an area where you can view a list of achievements that are built into our hub. And by participating in the game and gaining achievements within the hub, you'll move yourself up the leaderboard. And as you move up the leaderboard, you make yourself eligible to receive some dude swag, uh, to receive some gifts from the dude. And we're really looking forward to seeing everything that folks can uncover in the app, some of the hidden gems, um, and seeing who can finish at the top of the leaderboard and see who really wants that swag. You also have the ability in the event guide to look for sessions. Uh, so we can click here and look for any sessions. Uh, we can search by track for those sessions. You can also view attendees within the event guide. So if you click on the attendees link here, you can search for any attendees that are, that are at Dude University. And you can click on those attendees and send them a message. Add them as a contact. You do have a contacts list on the on the left hand side of your navigation menu as well. So you can create a list of people that uh, you've made contact with at Virtual Dude University. So I want to wrap up by saying to remember, you're going to log into the app. The number one thing you've got to do is you've got to come in and identify which sessions you want to take. Click on the plus icon to add them to your schedule and then click on a session and make sure you hit the view webcast link so that you can register for that session. That registration will allow you to, to participate day of. We're super excited to host our first ever Virtual Dude University and we cannot wait to see you next week.